First, the NBC Charlotte defenders all over a series of school bus fires. CMS staff inspecting bus number 188 today after it erupted in flames yesterday. They also inspected similar buses still on the road. Hello, everyone, and thank you for staying with NBC Charlotte. I'm Fred Shropshire. And I'm Sarah French. We're looking out for you asking tough questions about what's being done to keep your kids safe. CMS told us today they're launching a five point plan over growing concerns. No buses are being taken off the road, but similar buses will be reinspected and maintenance procedures reviewed. Defender Mark Boyle live at five. Mark, part of this plan includes a criminal investigation now. Police are involved in this and inspectors are looking at the buses in question, Fred. And now many parents are asking, is their child's bus safe? And we're looking out for you tonight. Investigators and CMS mechanics spent the day going through the charred remains of bus number 188. The bus headed to pick up students at Olympic High School burst into a ball of flames at Nations Ford and Downs Road Tuesday afternoon. When the fire erupted near the engine compartment of the bus, emergency personnel responded and extinguished the fire in a short time. No students on board. The driver got off safely. But now a major investigation is underway to determine what sparked that blaze. Remember back in October, we reported on bus 364 how it caught fire with at least 16 students on board? Well, it turns out both buses are the exact same make and model. Thomas Cat 3126 model. This is the same make and model as bus 364 which caught fire on October the 19th, 2017. CMS is at a crossroad. Two fires, no cause, no answers. And again, this is 364, which was in October, and the results were inconclusive. So the district doesn't know what sparked bus fire number one. Now they're investigating bus fire number two. Of the more than 1,400 school buses on the roads managed by CMS, 259, or 19%, are that CAT 3126 model now under investigation. I think they ought to uh, pull the buses before, some, before a child gets hurt or gets burned real bad. While the district, state inspectors, and Thomas mechanics work to figure out the cause, we found out police are involved looking at possible foul play. Now, parents, here's the information you need to know. If you want to know if your child's bus is one of those that they are looking at, you can go to our website, WCNC.com. We are publishing the information just released from CMS within the past 10 minutes. It'll take a few seconds for it to go through our website and get up there for you. When you see the link on our home page, that main page, click on it and you'll see a list of buses. If your child's bus number is on that list, it is one of those they are looking at tonight. I'm Mark Boyle reporting live tonight. Now back to you. So disturbing, Mark. Hopefully this gets resolved soon. Thanks for that report.